My name is Larissa Lai. I'm a professor of creative writing housed in the English department here at the University of Calgary. Through the pandemic, Asian and Asian looking people have been scapegoated for COVID. People have been attacked at bus stops, on sidewalks and in convenience stores. There's nothing new uh, in this history of race and racialization in Canada. There exist long-standing stereotypes of Asians as diseased. This is what my recent novel, The Tiger Flu, about a pandemic, but written before COVID, addresses. The, fi the fictional tiger flu of my novel is brought about by the de-extinction of the Caspian tiger, followed by an international craze for tiger bone wine. One of the two protagonists inherits the company that makes the wine and must deal with the waning power of her family as the world of production and consum consumption is itself collapsing. Asians in popular culture tend to be associated with the future, but not necessarily seen as human within it. Um, so if we think of a lot of our popular speculative fiction, right, it's always the white man who is seen as a human. One might think of Captain Kirk or Jean-Luc Picard or Buck Rogers. The Asians are seen as aliens, robots, cyborgs, insects, or monsters. My novels play with these tropes and try to turn them upside down. 